starting off our Saturday at a brunch spot here in Little Italy. We use this app called Pulse, which basically has a ton of vouchers. So right now we got a two for 45 three course meal with an hour of mimosas. So you already know how the day is about to go. Cheers. Cheers. Let me get another one. All right, since we have some guests with us, I'm gonna show them a little bit of my favorite neighborhood to go shopping in. Obviously, it's going to be Soho. Right now, we are in Nolita, but it's basically a very short walk to where we're trying to go, but we're with the whole squad, you already know. But I'm gonna show them a couple of my favorite stores around here, and let's go shopping. Alright, so right now we are on Broadway and Spring Street. This is basically where the start of Soho begins. There are a lot of shops around here. You have everything from Zara, Sephora, H&M, Aritzia. Just hit up Zara. I picked up a thing from H&M. And then later on, we're going to go further into Soho where there's a lot more of the bougier designer stores. But the weather is nice and, I mean, this is my area. I love shopping in Soho. Alright, next up we're hitting up Prada. This right here is a pretty unique store, especially since it's the Soho location. There are a lot of unique and boutique items that you can find here. It's also two stories, so we're gonna go check out and see what they have. Fingers crossed I don't buy anything. All right, right now we are over on Green Street. This is where you get pretty much all the iconic store. Louis Vuitton's right there, Dior, YSL. All the bougie stores are right on the street. So if you're ever looking for a one-stop shop where you can find all the good designer stores, definitely come right here on Green Street. All right, right now we are on Bleecker and Lafayette. This right here is the kids store. Pretty high BC store. Definitely a good selection of brands out there, but then right across the street is actually this place called Levain Bakery. It's pretty famous. They're pretty much known for their chocolate chip cookies. And man, this line is no joke right now. Look at this. And our final stop of this shopping day is obviously going to be, well, honestly, at this point, I really should be a value customer at the store. I should be getting some kind of discount because I spent way too much money here. Let's see what they got. Alright, I may or may not have been a bad influence on Todd. Terrible influence. But, I mean, it's the OVO store. Obviously one of the best stores here in Soho. Definitely recommend checking out if you're ever in New York. They got some fire pieces. Todd picked up this. Super Gorgeous cute. powder blue hoodie, and then I picked up some accessories. I'll show you guys when we get back to the house. All right, we have to make one more stop. I may be a bad influence because. I'd be getting everyone something. So Audrey just got the fire Yankees hat. Honestly, it looks so fire. I had to pick one up myself. But on Mainly Outdoor is definitely one of the trendiest stores here in Soho. They've got a cafe outside of it. So it's a super cool vibe. Honestly, definitely like my top three favorite stores here in Soho. All right, right now we're walking through a little Italy. This is where a bunch of restaurants are lined up and you can eat outside. They have some pretty authentic Italian cuisine. Definitely recommend if you're ever looking for a pasta, linguine, alfredo, things like that. But if you actually walk past little Italy, you're gonna go straight to Chinatown and that is our next location because it's time for some boba. <laughs> All right, one last stop before we head home. This right here is top tier boba. I would say probably the most fire boba spot in New York City. It's called Tiger Sugar. It's pretty well known, but it comes with this black sugar boba. And you just gotta shake it, but... It's hard, but it's like right. hand. Fire, but not life changing. Not life, you lied. Not life changing. You lied. All right, ladies. Mm, that's, that's really good. good. 
10 out of 10? 10 out of 10. Yeah, this Up is here. 10 out of 10. <laughs> Change my life will never be the same So close to grabbing the road I thank the Lord, I guess I'm hoping not It's hoping to change My life will never be the same So close to grabbing the road I thank the Lord, I got some hope, yeah I used to be so down in the dumps And I'm summer, so with lumps like the coma So black and hot was all right, right now we're starting off day two of the Soho itinerary. Right now we are on Lafayette Street. There's actually a pretty decent amount of stores around here. This one right behind me is called Showfields. To be honest, I've never been, but it seems to have a lot of unique brands, so let's check it out. Right now we're standing outside this store called Laced Up. It's actually one of the newer stores here in Soho, but they basically sell, as you can see, just a bunch of hype sneakers. There is one pair that I'm looking for. We're gonna see if they have it in stock, but it seems to be a popular attraction here in Soho. Right now I'm outside this store called Second Street. I actually found it via TikTok. There's actually a lot of vintage and designer brands that you're gonna find in here. To be honest, the prices aren't too bad. So if you're looking for more of an upper scale vintage thrift store, this might be the spot to check out. All right, and to end off this shopping vlog, we ended up at Cha Cha Matcha. This spot has some pretty decent matcha. They have everything from lattes to lemonades to even soft serve, especially on a hot summer day. Some nice iced matcha is always gonna hit the spot. But that's gonna wrap it up for today's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed seeing a couple of my favorite spots here in Soho. It's definitely one of my favorite neighborhoods to just walk around and chill out. If you guys enjoyed this video, please make sure to drop a like down below, and I'll see you guys in the next one.